Let's take a trip back in time. I remember when I bought my first laptop in late 2008. I worked an entire summer as a lifeguard in Spain just to save the money to buy it. Now it came pre-installed with an operating system and the only thing left for me to do was to actually just start using it. I was 19 back then and uh, I was actually a few years away from officially starting to work in cybersecurity. Yet I was aware of the bad stuff going on online. The threat landscape was complex even back then. So before I began playing with uh, the new toy, I looked for a solution to keep me safe uh, and protected from these online threats. Now, there were a few global big names in the industry and picking among the top three was actually no simple task. I remember I chose Malwarebytes because of its ability to protect against multiple types of threats and not just uh, serving as a simple antivirus. 14 years later, in 2022, standing the test of time, Malwarebytes has adapted to the ever-evolving online environment of threats and its new capabilities still succeed to surprise me. Its system requirements make it so that it can be easily installed on any system without putting a big burden on your resources. For reference, Malwarebytes uh, is installed more than 90,000 times each day and more than 200 million scans are conducted with Malwarebytes every month. When it boils down to its capabilities, its real-time protection engine uses artificial intelligence and machine learning to keep you protected from known, most importantly from unknown threats. And the keyword here are the unknown threats. Malwarebytes has the ability to protect against unseen threats as this is a core ability powered by machine learning. Its protection layers get you covered against web threats, malware, ransomware, and exploits. Now I could go on and on all day long discussing and detailing all that this powerful framework can do, but I think it's better if you discover that on your own. So if you struggle to make a decision on a solution to keep you protected online, I'd say go for Malwarebytes. There's a link in the description where you can try it out.